Well, hello everybody. Sorry, I've been MIA for a couple of weeks. I've just been trying to wrap my head around not being on the trail, going, figuring out what's going on with my body, and um, and then Plan B, getting back to the trail. So this is where we oh, stay. This is, this is here's the dealio, man. I uh, ended up with bilateral insufficiency stress fractures of the sacral spine, which kind of means that my upper body broke away from my lower body. <laughs> I blame it on the bear can. That bear can kicked my ass, literally. So that's where we're at. Um, they're, they've already done density tests and they're putting me on Prolia. I'm taking 5,000 units of vitamin D every day. I don't need calcium, my calcium is fine. The new thing about calcium is that they don't uh, load you up on calcium anymore because calcium goes everywhere. It's system systemic. So, um, and they don't want it to go to my arteries, obviously. So um, I get the Prolia and the vitamin D and then all the other vitamins that I take as well. So that's where we stayed. My daughter ended up house sitting, which worked out. She had an extra room there. So I stayed with her for three weeks while I waited for my renters uh, to move out of my house. They wanted to stay longer, but they understood. And while I was in LA, of course, I felt the earthquakes there, did the painting, and also at the house, which was really nice. It was kind of a nice break back into coming off the trail, back into the real world, is uh, the house had chickens and a garden. Chickens were just so wonderful. I just really enjoyed them. It, it just helped me make a transition off the trail um, for now. Would you look at that moon? Sure is party. Anyway, so lots of lots have been going on, but here here's my plan. Um, last year when I was getting ready to do the PCT, I didn't do, do a whole lot showing of my planning and my research and all that stuff. So uh, now that I'm kind of in the mode getting ready for next year, I need to plan what I'm going to do when, get my permit. The permits come up uh, available October 29th, so I'll get my permit. But the next thing I'm going to do here, even before then, is my gear video. Whee! <laughs> get in gear, baby! So I'll be doing my gear video. I've got everything laid out on the uh, on the uh, coffee table in the living room. So I'll be going through yeah. that. What's really, what I really like about doing the gear video now is that I, it's tried and tested and some things worked, some things didn't work. So I'll tell you all about it, why it did, why it didn't, what I changed to and why, what I didn't take and why. Oh, why, why? Tell me why you cry. You'll be back on the trail so soon. You got lots to do. <laughs> no, that didn't work. Okay, so as part of my rehabilitation and healing, uh, I rode down here to the beach with my daughter. She's doing a photo shoot down here. And uh, there's no sun. So, but it's still pretty. Down here at Santa Monica, watching the surfers. And there's the pier over there. Earthquake. Still going. Holy, holy. Still going.
And we brought the geckos out for a Sunday stroll. <laughs> They're so cool. Gecko on the run. Gecko <laughs> on the run. <laughs> Gecko girl. <laughs> In LA, went to a Starbucks. What kind of drink do you think an old hippie would get at a Starbucks? Tie-dye, just saying. So while we have Sarah here, house sitting in Los Angeles, at this house besides the chickens, there's this amazing garden. Have you ever seen what artichoke plants look like when they're growing? Right here. They're big old stalks. Got a little strawberry field, grape arbor, lemon and lime trees, Brussels sprouts, more artichokes. Lots of different peppers couple types of cucumber. We've got the, the English cucumber and the pickling cucumber. More peppers, basil, and lots of peppers and tomatoes. Well, of course she's out. Let her play out here. The owner said that they do let the chickens out. But we're still trying to figure out where she's getting out at. Let's go look and see if there's any eggs. Yep, he's out. <laughs> or she's out. What are you doing out here? Hey, bark, 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 bark. What did you do? How do you get out? Oh, do you have any eggs? Oh, we got two sitters. We got two sitters. You got any eggs for us? Huh? You got any eggs? Mm. <laughs> you got any eggs for me? What? We have an announcement. <laughs> we have an egg. Come on. Can I get your egg? We have an egg. No egg. It's a baby. No egg right now. We'll have one later. We'll have one later. Yeah. So sweet. Such a sweet chicken. Yeah. The chorus. What up, girls? Would you look at these chickens? They are having a heyday. There's two chickens there. <laughs> what are you? They're taking dirt baths. <laughs> They're fighting over the same hole. Rolling in the dirt. <laughs> hey. Abby, boo. <laughs> oh, we 
есть. You're so handsome. You're so handsome. <laughs> so, um, so I have my hot rod walker. I can walk with it for long distances, but no hiking, absolutely no hiking until uh, the end of November, December, they say. So that kind of rules out anything on the PCT for this year. So I've got some camping trips planned with my hiking club, which will be great. And so that'll keep me outdoors. Okay, so one thing I just learned, wilderness wash is like for cleaning or bathing or dishes it is not mouthwash. <sighs> Okay, so today I'm headed back to REI to take some things back that I didn't need or use. Of course, I have my receipts, but I think REI keeps track of everything as well. But here's what I got for you. <laughs> I'm not going to use the bear spray. Um, I did take it and this thing weighs a ton. And maybe if I were bigger or had somebody carrying stuff for me, <laughs> I would take the bear spray, but I'm not going to use the bear spray. I've got my neck knife. And um, I've got, I got these mosquito bands that I heard work real well, but I mean, what can I say? I've got my bug suit, so I don't, I don't need the little bands. I've got my whole big bug suit, which you will see. <laughs> and Aqua Mira, these are water treatments um, on top of filtering. I have the tablets, which are much lighter. You know, when you're getting all this stuff, you just don't think about it. But uh, I don't know how much this weighs, but it's very heavy. This is the liquid. And if you do need to double treat, uh, I do have the little tiny tablets that work just as well. And ouch, ouch. Okay. My Sawyer Squeeze, I never used it. I only used um, my Bee Free. So don't need the Sawyer, got my Bee Free. And let's see. And then I had gotten a platypus bottle, um, but I never used it. And uh, my Bee Free really worked out for that. And then the bottles, that's all I needed. So I didn't need anything extra on that. And my crampons. <laughs> I didn't have them when I needed them, but uh, I'm putting everything towards getting a couple other extra light things too. So I can get my crampons next year but uh, I need to get I have other priorities right now with my equipment so with my gear so so that's that so off to REI I go and uh, start the next chapter of getting ready for hiking more of the PCT <laughs> so that is one of the great things about REI that I just think is amazing is that uh, you're able well I guess a lot of stores but especially REI uh, they will take equipment back that uh, you haven't used and even I think if something is gently used you still get to take some things back but uh, quite amazing thank you REI as I almost trip <laughs>